crab under there. <laughs> Y'all, we finally made it downtown. We about to go ahead into this parking garage and start this video. Here go a little. Yo, this is like my fourth or fifth time coming here since I got my car. Y'all know this this like a one of the main places I took my car when I first got it. I was I was shooting up and down this street like crazy because it's loud. As y'all see, it's loud. But it wasn't loud as it is now because that's when I first got my car. We should get on some scooters, y'all. Uh. Alright, y'all. So we just got by the, uh, the river. Here go the. Let me run my window down so y'all can see a little bit better. There go the over there. Okay, there y'all got me. But yeah, I'm about to go ahead and find somewhere where uh, I can park the car and we're going to start this video. I ain't even tell y'all for real what it's going to be about, but y'all going to see. Alright y'all, so we finally got into the parking garage. We about to go all the way to the top. Let's see how long that takes. I think it's seven levels. Yo, is y'all serious? Look at this. I come all the way up here. Just for, that, just for me to see his block. I wonder if I can move, but I know I'm not supposed to. Yeah, you most definitely can move it, but should I? I don't know, y'all. We gon' see. Y'all, don't say no. It was already open. I ain't do that. Trust me. If I can get the ticket, y'all gonna pay for me? Y'all gonna pay for it for me? Just because I'm making this video all the way up here. I wanted the builders in the back. That's for real why I wanted to come all the way over here. But we gonna see. What if it's like a hole, like in the, like, or like I'm not supposed to be over here because it's gonna crack? Yeah, I for sure need it. Cause look at this view, like, yeah, I for sure need to come up here. Y'all see the sunroof. All right, y'all, so I'm parking my car right now. Uh, I'm about to back it in, so the view uh, behind me is gonna be the towers. It's gonna look pretty sweet, pretty sweet. But yeah, y'all, so this video is gonna be five things that I love. And five things I hate about my scat pack. Uh, I know a couple people wanted me to make this video, so that's why I'm making it. I ain't got no other, no nothing else to do today, and I had no other ideas. So I'm just looking through my phone, like what's some things that people are telling me to make, and this is one of them. But yeah, we're gonna do five things. We're gonna get straight into this. I ain't gonna cap, and then we're gonna go get some food later. I gotta put y'all on to this restaurant down here, but it's gonna be good. No kids. But yeah, y'all, we're gonna get straight into this video. Uh, I'm gonna start off with the first things that I love about my, uh, the first five things I love about my car. But yeah, y'all, my bad. But uh, we're gonna start off with the first five things I love about my car. And we're gonna get straight into it. Then we're gonna get, uh, then we're gonna go into five things I hate about my car. But yeah, let me show y'all a little view of before we start this, as y'all see, my car is beautiful. We all the way up at the top. There go Canada, some buildings from Canada. Then you go all the way around, then you got some more buildings. I bet people up here are like, what is he doing? But yeah, here go the whip, y'all. I'm gonna take some pictures and put these on the gram because it's hard with the back, with the, uh, and what's them things, what's them buildings called? The GM buildings, I think. <laughs> But yeah, I wonder how far up we is too. Oh yeah, we a distance up for sure. I wonder if I could have went. Yeah, I could have just went in this garage because it goes all the way up. Dang, somebody was spinning a junk over there. Y'all, should I spin my junk? Y'all see them little marks on? Huh? Let me let it zoom in. On the top of the garage, somebody was spinning a junk. Y'all think I should spin my junk? <laughs> Shoot, I could probably spin this up right here. Shoot, I could do it right here for real. But I ain't about to do all that. I ain't got no nobody to record for real. Oh yeah, this hard. Hey, they got grass on top of the building. I wonder if it's real. It probably is. Hopefully I'm gonna drive my camera. Cause y'all would never see me again or never see any of this footage unless the SD card don't break. There go a ship over there too. Here go a better view of, uh, of Canada, y'all. Y'all see, it's a little boat over there. Let's see what they doing on that boat. They 
probably being freaky on that book. Can't even see nothing. But yeah. If you're new to the channel, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. We about to go crazy this whole summer. I ain't gonna we gonna keep dropping videos like y'all saw. I dropped a video yesterday. Uh, or the day before. Well, yeah, it was yesterday. Uh, a day in the life of someone who drives a scat pack. But yeah, we gonna get straight into this video. No cap. So the first thing that I love about my car, for real, I love listening to music. If you know me personally, I love miss listening to music. Uh, that's all I do. So really, I got the upgraded uh, Harman Kardon. Hold on, let me show you real quick. Y'all see right here? I got the Harman Kardon uh, speakers, the system in my car. Uh, it's a speaker system. The uh, original one, I think it's, it's called Alpine or something like that. Correct me if I'm wrong, but yeah. Uh, I love the music, how it sounds. People be saying that I have, uh, like, they be like, what sound system you got in here? Like, no, this is just regular upgraded uh, Harman Kardon, and it be banging for real. I, yeah, let me show y'all just like a little... I was gonna say I don't want to because of copyright, but I can just put like a little bit of a clip in there. Let me show y'all real quick. Hold on, y'all. All right, y'all. So I don't know what I'm gonna play yet, but hold on. Let me make sure it's turned all the way up so we can just play a little clip of it. Let's see what we're gonna throw into this video. Let's listen to Gunna. Pushing P. I'm pushing P. All right, baby, we're gonna play this one. All right, y'all, so I know y'all can hear me, but I got my music. I don't got the auto yet, but it's kind of loud. I'm going to keep talking over the music, so hopefully I don't get copyrighted, but it's going to be banging. All right, y'all, I can't play no more. I don't want to get copyrighted. <laughs> All right, y'all, so none of this is in order for real. Uh... Like what I love more than other things is just all like five things. I ain't, it's not really in order or nothing like that. But the next thing that I love about my car is obviously the color. It's indigo blue, and I'm gonna uh, add the uh, the wide body onto this too. So it's two on one. So I love the wide body kit on my car, and I love the color. As y'all see, I got indigo blue. This thing be here when it's clean, but once it's dirty, it be looking a little bit off. But as y'all see right now, the sun, well, it's not really no sun, not for real, but in the summer, it be beaming like crazy. But yeah, I love the color. And then y'all see the wide body on chargers. It just look amazing. Well, wide bodies on challengers, everything for real. It look good. But yeah, I'm not going to say there's no hate on all the slim body chargers, but the wide body chargers, they look the best, in my opinion. It just gives it a whole different car look for real. But yeah, that's another thing that I love. That's the second thing that I love about this car. So I love the uh, speakers, the Harman Kardon. That's what they're called. And then I love the color. And then the wide body, as y'all see, the fenders. It adds, I think, like two or three inches to the car. But yeah, that's the second thing that I love about my All car. Alright y'all, so the third thing, I had to put my hood on bro, it's getting cold, getting windy, all that. But yeah, so the third thing that I love about my car is the 485 horsepower beast that this thing be pushing. Uh, I love the sound too, so I'm going to put that together too. So I love the sound and the power of my car. Let me start it real quick for y'all and get y'all some revs. So as y'all hear, this thing sounds amazing. Well, anyway, uh, I'm thinking about taking the rear mufflers off and putting five inch tears, making it a little bit louder, making it a little bit more deeper and more aggressive. It's already loud enough, but yeah, and the cops already be messing with me enough and it'd be irritating because they'd be like, you're going so fast. And really, it's just my car is loud, so it sounds like we're going fast. But yeah, that's the third thing I love about this car. I love the sound and the power of this car. Uh, you can be at a light. Well, now I'm not going to be saying you got to be a light. You could be uh, turning, hit the gas, and it just start sliding. And I love that. Like, it's a powerful machine. It's pushing uh, 485 horsepower. Oh, I'm thinking about getting the cold area take, too. And then I'll probably be pushing over 500. And 
I believe it's 500. I believe it adds like 15 to 20 horsepower. So it'd be about 500 horsepower. But yeah, that's uh, the third thing that I love about this car. All right, y'all, so I ain't about to go outside for this one. Uh, I could be here in this cozy area because it's cold outside. But for the fourth thing that I love about this car is it brings a lot of attention to my YouTube channel, to y'all. So it's basically starting my YouTube, uh, for real. Uh, I've always, like I've always said before, uh, since I was like 10, probably not, probably before I was 10, uh, I always wanted to do YouTube. I love recording, I love posting, and I love getting reactions and, uh, feedback. Whether it's positive or negative, it doesn't really matter to me. Uh, it's all the same. I don't really take negative feedback any different from positive, because it's just what, what somebody feels or how they, how they feel about your video. But yeah. I love the attention that it's bringing to my YouTube channel. The fourth thing I love about this car is it brings a lot of attention to my YouTube channel. So the fifth and the last thing that I like about this car is sunroof and the red Alcantara red guts with the bumblebee in the middle. But it's really like a big accent because you know you got the red brake calipers i'm gonna end up changing all of this anyway except the red interior because i'm gonna end up wrapping the car wrapping the brake calipers changing the rims all that but that's in the summertime i'm just letting these ride out for the winter time i ain't trying to mess well i ain't trying to get some new stuff right now and have it all messed up because of the weather or anything like that but yeah i love the red Alcantara red seats and i love this sunroof i always wanted the car with the sunroof uh, it just adds more to the car, especially in the summer. Uh, or like, just like me when I was driving all the way up here, I had the sunroof open so you can see all the buildings out when you look up. I don't know, it's just something that adds onto the car. I love it, and I, I'm, I'm gonna add this on here too, but I love this carbon fiber dash, and it got carbon fiber right here too. I also wanted to get like a little carbon fiber sticker or a decal that goes over all of this. That's five things, or it was probably more than five things, but that's everything that I love about this car. That's not everything that I love about this car, but that's just like the main things that brings attention to this car. The power, the sound, the color, the wide body, the sunroof, the red guts, the carbon fiber. But yeah, that's basically almost everything. Well, that's five things that I love about this car. All right, y'all, so let's move on to the five things that I hate about this car. It's not that I completely hate, but I don't like about this car. So the first thing I'm pretty sure you can ask anybody that has a V8 is the gas in this car. Bro, you could put at least 40, 50, 60 dollars every day. If you drive two, three, four hours, you, you're gonna be putting a whole bunch of money into this car. Hey y'all, that's something that I hate about this car is the gas. The gas prices, especially the prices right now, are crazy. So you're already putting a lot of gas into the car because it eats gas like crazy. I'm pretty sure well, I get like 11 miles per gallon. And I like to drive and track a lot, so that's probably one thing. But I did drive on auto for a long time before, and it was still like terrible. It's probably like 12 at the most, but not even. But yeah, that's the first thing. We can get that straight off the way because that's the first thing. I'm pretty sure that's the most thing that I hate about this car. Or I don't like about this car. So second of all, like I was just talking about, this is the second thing that I don't like about this car. Let me show you real quick. So you look at this steering wheel. You see it says Dodge. It's nice. It got some nice leather or whatever. But why does the V6 have this steering wheel? And then you get a V8 and it has the same exact steering wheel. It got the same, probably everything. It probably, I don't know if it has the heated steering wheel, but let me write this. Sixes, all Durango V6s, V8s, they all have the same steering wheel. Like, why can't this be car? You get the carbon fiber, right? Why is it not focusing? You see, you get the carbon fiber, the package, and then you got the suede package also. That's something I like about this car. I didn't add that on, but anyway. Besides that, you get the carbon fiber package, and then you got this gray stuff right here. Like, why can't this be carbon fiber? Why can't this say scat pack or three knot, like it says right here, three knot two with the bone B? Why can't it say that right here? Like, you get the V8, you get the scat pack, you pay all that money. Who is this person? They over here coming over here, like, and I open that thing down there, so they look probably like, ooh. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, that's. The second thing that I don't like about this car is the steering wheel. It's real basic. I wish this was uh, 
what is that? Uh, Elk, like the Elkater right here. I wish it was on this steering wheel. I know all Hellcats or whatever they got that, and they say SRT. But why can't mine say it's a V8 too? A Hellcat is a V8. But why can't it say? Uh, why can't the steering wheel say Scat Pack or SRT or something instead of Dodge? Like it's so basic. Like, and it's a big difference uh, compared to them cars. And they got the same exact steering wheel. And yeah, that's the second thing that I hate about this car. We're gonna move on to the next. One. All right, y'all. So the third thing that I don't like about this car, and I hate about this car, this should probably be the first thing because it's it's something that's been affecting me a lot lately this last month. Is it brings a lot of attention to the cops. Uh, everywhere you go, you got cops staring at you. You got cops getting behind you. They they checking your place to see if it's your car. Especially all V8s, Hellcats, Scat Packs, Trackhawks, any nice car. Well, I don't know if it's any other brands that they be messing with. Any other models they be messing with. But especially Scat Packs, Hellcats. Cops get behind you. They pull you over for no reason. Like I, I, I think I've explained in one video. A cop said I threw a cigarette butt out the window. He was making that up. To, so he can get my license and registration just to see if it's my car and yeah they be making up anything for real they i don't know and one cop put me out of my car they cuffed me it was it's a long story but just because i drive a scat package i drive a fast car i drive a nice car cops are going to be messing with you uh if you ever want to get one of these cars be prepared to get harassed discriminated all that Getting mess with cops because they gonna mess with you like crazy and I'm not lying you will find out for yourself But that's the third thing that I hate and I do not like about this car Y'all look so y'all know I opened that little thing down there and I show y'all them little people came up here And then they was asking like hey, can we take a picture with y'all car? I was like it don't even matter go ahead <laughs> But they about to say these little pictures. I'm gonna get out their way It's cold Man, though. it's cold Y'all we finally done had somebody to come up here they better not come over here and mess with us. <laughs> but they still over here taking pictures. Yeah, so them, them people had took some pictures with my car for whatever. I wasn't really tripping. So I'm just showing love for it. That picture gonna be looking way harder now. Cause they, you know, the scat in the back. But yeah, look y'all. So the, he back there right there sitting, waiting for me to move. But yeah, we gonna go ahead. I'm already knowing that it's gonna mess with me cause we ain't supposed to be up here. But yeah. Uh, we about to go ahead and get the other little two things that I don't like about this car. As soon as that, we go down here. All right, y'all. So the fourth thing that I don't like about this car is I don't know why they getting out that car coming over here. I ain't doing that wrong. I got off the la the last level. As you know, this is Scat Pack. You don't get a red key or anything. This is a regular Dodge key. But then you go get a V6 car. It got the same Dodge key as this one. Why mine can't be a little bit different? That's the fourth thing that I don't like about this car. Is why this can't be a little bit different. Uh, than all the other V6 and other Dodge vehicles. Because this is a V8. You pay a lot more. And it's a scat pack. And you get this key. But yeah. That's the fourth thing that I don't like about this car. Uh, so last but not least. The last thing that I do not like about my Dodge Charger scat pack wide body is that when you hit the gas you can't utilize the power uh all you do is spin out so if you want to go fast if you want to race somebody from the start you're going to be getting new tires a lot and them are very expensive too but yeah you can't it's like the car has too much power for the wheels but it's like a good and a bad thing but because if i mean it's good to have a lot of power when you're going but from the start it's not because all it's gonna do is spin out and then after a while you end up just having to buy tires and i've been having a lot of fun in my car like i said so even from just taking off at the light you'll be burning rubber in the back if you want to just smash the gas and go like it's not just gonna go you'll just end up spinning out because uh, the car has too much powers to put on the floor and to get traction but yeah if that makes complete sense uh, hopefully you guys know what I'm trying to say, but Y'all look, I'm over here driving Look at the sun, bro, that's on cold It's like hanging out of the clouds 
All right, y'all. So I just put this <laughs> to my cousin. I was like, I got to block all this stuff so y'all can't see where, where she live. But I finally got my custom play card. I put like five different options. And the first one, they said it was sexual, so I couldn't use it. But we're going to see. We're going to take it off. I would say I'm a scat, I think. Is that but, what you put? I'm a scat? Yeah. We were trying to figure out so hard what it was. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to see what it we gonna see what it look like. Y'all, so as y'all see, my my place said I'm a scat with a one. But y'all, so I had put O-M-W, the number two, and then F-Y-B. If y'all understand, if y'all young, that's on my way to F, you know. Yeah. But anyway, they declined that, and they said it was sexual, so I couldn't get that. And then I put too fast. And then I put too slow, and then I put I'm a scab. But they chose this one. So, y'all, I finally got my play. I'm about to go put this on there probably right now. All right, y'all. So, I finally I put my plate on, as y'all can see. It say like, I'm a scat with a number one. Like I said, they wouldn't. Uh, look, I'll just show y'all this. That's what I was supposed to get on my way to FYB. It was, to, it was gonna be real funny or whatever, but yeah. This the one I got right now. I just put it on. It's just two little screws. You take it off, and I'm about to get like a little cover. It's like a scap uh cover or whatever. But yeah, y'all, I finally got my plate. I'm lit. All right, y'all. So I just put it to Walmart. I'm about to get this little stuff in my cart. It's like a little scent thing to make it smell better. But yeah, we just put it to Walmart. I gotta walk all the way in the auto station because that's where it's at. But yeah, y'all, it's like. 11 it's 10 right now they're closing our hours but i'm about to just grab this stuff from my car to me it's no good i'm gonna show y'all what i'm talking about as soon as we get there all right y'all so this is everything i'll grab got the same thing uh sprays in your car we put the air on put it on full close out the close the doors get out the car and then put the blood on and then start spraying there got a little scent bomb as you can see and I got also I got these two things, uh, an interior cleaner and a tire shine because I'm running out of that. I think I told y'all that earlier, but yeah, I got these two. As y'all can see, uh, I recorded a lot today. Uh, I did the five things I love slash like versus the five things that I hate and I don't like about this car. Uh, I appreciate it if y'all like this video. Uh, if you did, comment down below another video I should make. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And we're gonna keep going up all 22, 2022, 20, all summer. But yeah, y'all, I appreciate y'all. Make sure y'all be safe. Peace out. Yo, one more thing. I was just about to go into the crib. Let me turn my car on and say all this real quick. Hold on, y'all. Don't don't dip nowhere or nothing like that. Look at the new top speed on the scat. Y'all ready? I hit 161 today. Uh, it was on the open freeway. Freeway. It was real open. And it was just straight, no cars, no turns, no nothing, just a straightaway. I ain't that crazy now, but look, 161. If y'all want me to beat this, let me know down below and I'll make a video on that. I'll see y'all.